Good morning guys and welcome to a, another vlog of mine. This is my third vlog, super excited. We are doing a last minute trip to New Zealand with my mum and my stepdad. Just pulled up to like the airport parking to park my car. I haven't done my eye makeup so I'm gonna sit here and do that and then we're gonna head to the airport. But it is so cold this morning and it's apparently snowing in New Zealand where we're going. the duty free to just get like heaps of cheap alcohol but yeah we're gonna go get something to eat and then I think we're boarding our plane in like an hour Eyes in the sky gazing far into the night I raise my hand to the fire but it's no use we are now boarding our plane finally we're waiting for like ages but Finally getting on. I'm just most excited about eating the food to be honest and I kind of want to have like a wine or something just cuz guys look how fat my head was in Christchurch it is so cold my ankles are freezing but we're just gonna go and get our bags now and then go see Nana what do I say I don't know what do you want to say hi 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 you should show them the flowers I got I will I'm going to in a second wait I don't know if you'd like red roses or but you like them. thank you how cute are they from this little monster so we just got off the plane and I didn't know anyone was coming here to meet us but my stepmom Kath and my niece Skylar came. They were so cute and they got me flowers. I would have vlogged if I hadn't known someone was like waiting for me to come out. But anyway, mum and I are just getting coffee and I'm having a hot chocolate and we're about to go out in the cold. We're just on our way to Timaru. It's raining, it's cold, it's like so miserable outside. I think it's like a two hour drive from the airport but we've been driving for a little while now so should be there soon I just got to my auntie Debbie's house and I'm sitting by her little fire mum's over there and this is my auntie and her cute little house it's like an A-frame house I'll have to show you in the morning when we can see and we're just about to go and see my nana this is my auntie's little house it's an A-frame house so it's like nine o'clock we've just got back from the hospital and we're gonna go to bed Good morning. so it is now the next day i didn't do a lot of vlogging yesterday afternoon because the whole reason that we came over was to see my nana and she's in the hospital so i kind of focused on that but today we'll be going there soon but we're gonna go out for breakfast soon but i thought i'll show you what i'm wearing so this is just another top from kukai with a low back and these jeans are also from factory I've been curling my hair and then pretty much it stays like this until I wash it so I literally just have to get up in the morning brush it and that's it I thought I would just say to you guys why it is that we've come to New Zealand in a hurry I had to leave Mason at home but basically my Nana got diagnosed with pretty much every cancer 
that there is and she's in hospital at the moment so we just wanted to come and see her and make sure we could see her you know like before anything happened and just be by her side so that's why we're here um so i'm probably not gonna vlog a, a whole heap of stuff because most of the time we will just be in the hospital by her bed making sure she's okay and that she's got everything she needs and literally just sitting there and being with her which has been really nice we saw her last night and she's still in her silly spirits and saying her silly things like she always does so that was really nice to see i think we're about to head off now and just go and get some breakfast so i'm gonna go inside put my boots on put my jacket on and then go get some breakfast i'll show you guys what i have because that's so exciting just got to our place for breakfast we're just across the road from caroline base so when we're finished eating i'll show you guys there because it's really pretty eyes in the sky gazing far into the night i raise my hand New Zealand people in shops are so much more friendly than what they are in Australia. Do you reckon? Like it's so like you're New going. Zealand people in the shops in Australia are unfriendly. Yeah, they're unfriendly. <laughs> they're just more welcoming. They are. I'm just, I'm just like I just find that over here everyone is so much more friendly wherever you go. Like it's like you're gonna go see old friends, but you don't even know who they are. Anyway, and so. No, but I was thinking the other day, like I find it really funny how Kiwis always wear Kiwi clothing, like they'll always have like silver ferns on or like all blacks and stuff like that and then you go to Australia. Like no one wears Australian t-shirts. I think it's funny that no one wears anything in Australia, but in New Zealand like everyone rips all the New Zealand stuff. I'm just going to show you guys where I grew up. So this is Caroline Bay and I used to do like lots of talent quests and always do performing and their little Bay Piazza thing. I think that's what it's called. Down here in that little dome thing that we used to always perform for the little talent quest. It was so much fun. So many memories there. This is just where we're having breakfast, the place that says Bay Hill. We are only staying here for three nights in total so we got in last night and then we stay again tonight but then the next night which is Saturday night we have to be up at 12 a.m. so at like midnight to go to the airport which I'm gonna be so tired it's gonna be such a long day. We've just come to a cafe in New Zealand and these are like my favorite things they're called cheese rolls and it's just like bread rolled up toasted and it's got like soup mix and cheesy stuff in it and it's so yummy and this is like my favorite thing New Zealand lolly cake this is the main street of Timaru so this is my hometown we're having a, a hat night at my auntie's house she makes these little hats out of felt and here's my auntie Debbie <laughs> with her hat on we're not retarded. we're having a hat parade I call this the crocodile Dundee hat this one is it on backwards no I don't know this hat here and you can pull the top up and have it sticking up in the air. This is the Peter Pan hat. The Peter Spidey is just going to go and milk the goat. Oh, this one's cool. <laughs> Rita, will you milk the goats for me this morning? <laughs> I keep on putting her hats on backwards. <laughs> this is a cool one too. And lots of them you can cover your eyes, which is really handy. If you don't want to see anything <laughs> good morning so it is now the next day we are just waiting for mum's cousin to come over and see them this is our last day pretty much in Tamaru so at 2 a.m. tonight well tomorrow morning we have to get up and go to the airport and we fly back to Brisbane at 6 45 so today is gonna be a really long day and there's lots of people coming to the hospital lots of family and my dad's also coming down from Christchurch to have lunch with me I think with my nieces and his wife and my sister as well so we've just got to the hospital for our last day with Nana this is the little Timaru hospital <laughs> go <laughs> go do a silly one quick got it we need a paper tissue and the milk has got to eat that first thank you just don't eat the tissue don't eat the tissue me if I do <laughs> We're just having lunch with my dad. Say hi. Don't we look like identical? <laughs> look how happy you are. It's a video. Yeah. Oh, I was waiting on you to change my face. <laughs> <laughs> it's not Snapchat. 
My beautiful nieces, Lilica and Skylar. The girls just got their food and it's got a little umbrella on it and a lollipop So my dad is really well known for playing the bagpipes. And I'm pretty sure someone asked him to do it at their wedding once. <laughs> But I don't think they quite understood that he does it with a chair on his head. <laughs> Dad's going to now show you guys how he plays the bagpipes with a chair on his head. No, he's not. Yes, Come he is. On. No. Come on, Dad. <laughs> this is what we do for dinner to have fun. Lilica's one just fell off. You know, there's a world record for people who can put most things on their face. Really? If you practice enough, you'll get the record. <coughs> this is how the little kids' dessert comes. So you like put whatever you want on your little ice cream. I want a pink one. This is my dad's car. How cool is it? We just fitted like 50 of us in here to go to the playground. Off we go for a family ride on the horse. Come on. Oh, there's a hill we have to stand on. Ah. Here comes a jump. Lean forward. So we're gonna go and have just one little drink at this little bar and then we're gonna go to sleep and then in like four hours or something ridiculous we have to get back up to go to the airport. I'm just having a melon slice so it's got Malibu, melon liqueur, pineapple juice and cream. There's nothing to do in New Zealand apart from stick coins on this thing. So we are just boarding our flight now um, to go back to Brisbane. So we got up at 2 a.m. and it was like minus three degrees or something like that. But I stopped vlogging because I got really sick and I was vomiting all morning. So feeling better now. I've just had like a muffin to eat and we're just going down to board now. Backlash written on me, card rubbing on a glass bowl. I've been falling. Free my ladies in the counter now. I'm already out, already on the countdown. I'ma set it right. Got the backlash written on me, cold running from the pole, pole and it's on me. Don't know which way we're going now, I don't wanna know it. Might as well be going down, I don't wanna know it. I got the backlash written on me, car dropping on a glass bowl, I've been falling. Free my ladies in the counter now. I also and I decided to come to South Bank and we didn't realize that there's like a crazy festival on and it's so packed today. So we're just trying to find somewhere super quiet or oh, something's going on over there. We're just trying to find somewhere like super quiet to go and eat and it is literally like so crazy packed. I'll show you guys soon. But yeah, I thought I don't get any time away from Mason for like another two or three weeks. So I was like, I'm going to make the most of it and just go get some lunch first. And then after this, I'll go and pick Mason up. Before we go, I just want to ask you guys something. So, I want to know what you guys do when you guys wear body suits. How do you go to the toilet? Like, leave a comment below. I think it'll be really interesting to just see what everyone does. I wear body suits a lot of the time, and it seems to be a bit of a dilemma as to do people undo them at the bottom or do they pull them to the side? I. I'm going to admit right now that I pull mine to the side and I like hook it over my bum cheek when I go to the toilet. Um, yeah, I'm pretty much all for giving you guys all the details. So that's what I do. So leave a comment below and let me know what you do when you wear a bodysuit. I'm going to finish my vlog here. 
it's probably been completely all over the place in New Zealand I did spend like so much of my time at the hospital so we didn't really get out to do a lot of things and I didn't want to vlog inside the hospital and whatnot I don't know how well everything's gone together but I hope you guys enjoyed watching whatever I have come up with um, but yeah I'm just about to pick up Mason now from his dad's and I'm really excited to see him I haven't seen him since Thursday today is now Sunday afternoon and I need to get him ready for kindy and get all his kindy lunch stuff ready so I'm literally going to finish this vlog here because I'm so excited to see my baby and I just want to spend time with him and cuddle him and kiss him and, you know, whatever. So, yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed watching. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the thumbs up button. It just lets me know that you enjoy watching my videos, basically. But, yeah, this is the end of my video and I really hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more videos from me and hit the thumbs up button because it lets me know that you guys are enjoying my videos. So yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video.